What is going on guys, Grave here. Today I'll talk about the ability timers here in the Elder Scrolls Online and how they're not working properly on console. Now I know this is just a console thing. I don't think it's happening on PC. Of course, this is with the new ability timers that we have added in. And I know some people on PC probably still use add-ons. They don't use the built-in ability timer option. And I'm assuming this is probably happening on Xbox as well. Of course, I play here on PlayStation, but I'm sure most of you have noticed by now, sometimes when you place your abilities down and you swap bars that the uh, ability timer does not work. So, for example, the big problem I have, and you'll see it throughout this gameplay, is when I throw my wall down here and I swap bars, uh, it doesn't show the timer counting down. Whether I want a DPS character, my tank, whatever the case may be, a healer, it doesn't work the majority of the time. Now, sometimes I can go in and every single ability timer works on both bars through whatever I'm doing. But for the most part, only usually two or three are working on each bar, and there's one or two that are not. And I know this is a problem with stam, mag characters, tanks, like I said, healers, whatever the case may be here on console. Of course, I'm really grateful that the devs have added this in. You know, we have this universal kind of ability timer thing now. Like I said, it's on all platforms. I know people on PC may still use uh, some of the, you know, add-ons and things. But for newer players, I know it's a real frustration if you're trying to get used to using these timers with, you know, DPS bills and things like that. For me, it's not that big of a deal for, for one reason. Of course, when I first started playing the game almost seven years ago now here on console, we had no timers whatsoever. Then we had the old timer system where only a few abilities showed timers. So a lot of this stuff I kind of just remember because I've played it for so long and done it for so long that, you know, it's just kind of just, I guess, ingrained in my brain to when to swap and, and cast your ability again, that kind of thing. But overall, I really hope this gets looked at because I think this was a great new addition to the game. It was going to help out with rotations on console a lot for, you know, older players like myself and new players alike. I mean, it was great for that because there might be a time or two where I still might miss something, you know, even though I'm used to doing it, I still may miss, you know, times here and there something drops off when it shouldn't. So hopefully uh, Zoss can look at this. I know there has not been a lot of discussion about it in uh, the PTS patch notes, but of course, like I said, I know a lot of PC players probably are not using the built-in in-game tracker system that we have now they're probably still using add-ons but hopefully Zoss can look at this because really these timers on console are pretty broken and i know that a lot of people have been talking about it i have talked about it with other guild members in my guild and other guilds in uh or at least on playstation and a lot of people seem to be having this problem so leave me a comment let me know your thoughts are you playing on playstation or xbox and you're having this issue and if you ever played on pc or you do play on pc and you use the new built-in in-game tracker do you see the same issues on pc like i said it is frustrating uh, like I said, for me, just personally, because it's something that I think really is great to have in the game and I enjoy having it and being able to use it. But I know for newer players that are really trying to get used to getting a good uh, rotation down, it is a big help. And it would be nice if all the ability timers worked properly. And I know, of course, it's something new that was brought in with Blackwood. So it's going to have to be tweaked here and there. But I kind of want to bring some you know, information to you guys, let you all know that there is an issue with it. And of course, you can't always tweet Zoss or, or send them a, a message in game you know, some kind of ticket so you can tell them they're not working properly and hopefully they will get, you know, kind of on top of it and get it fixed sooner rather than later. Anyway, guys, let me comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliate here on the channel, Empire Jerky, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.